Seemed like the your visitors kind of took it to you there in the fourth quarter. You know, what can you say about you know just your boys' effort to stay in the game and keep fighting? I think the first half we did a pretty nice job um, keeping up with Marshfield. Give credit to Marshfield; they are a very strong team for 4A. Um, I think we executed okay in our zone offense set in the first half, and we came out really flat in the third. And I think that really made the difference. And by that time, it was just a, a shootout that we couldn't recover from. You mentioned that you know you're missing one of your better players tonight, you know, nursing a rib injury. Um, you know what's the plan? You know moving forward with him. You know when do you expect him back? Well, hopefully we got some good news that he'll be back on Monday. Um, he was originally supposed to be gone a couple weeks, but it's nice that we're learning to play without him. The the experience that all my other teammates, or my players, are getting, it's huge. I mean, regardless of the outcome. It's nice that we're playing the way we are, so then when we do have our other player come back, we can take that and run with it coming into the league. Now, you mentioned the third quarter was a little bit of an issue for you guys, but the fourth quarter, you know, you guys turned it on, a lot of energy from all the way down the bench. You know, what can you say about, you know, your guys' just willingness to never give up? You know, and I, I think that's something I, I would hope that I'm instilling with my program and my boys is no matter what the final score is, is we're going to fight as hard as we can. Um, I don't want us to just give up. You know, I, I want people to recognize Newport Cub basketball is we're fighting for 32 minutes regardless of the final score. Now, what was the defense doing to you, allowing you to get those shots? Oh, they're, um, well, they weren't really, like, too uh, disciplined on defense. I mean, they, they still got a couple steals, but we just need to handle the ball a little harder, a little better. Um, we just, good movement just causes uh, good shots, kind of like watching the NBA, how Rockets always move the ball. Now, what can you say about your confidence? You know, it seemed like you were pulling up, you know, it didn't matter who was in your face, you were hitting the shots. Yeah. What can you say about that? Uh, you know, just coming into high school, uh, old coach has always taught me to keep shooting, you know. He gave me the confidence, told me I'm the best shooter in the state, and uh, don't ever let anyone else tell me to stop shooting. Mm -hmm. 